While in Volterra, a stop at the Guarnacci Etruscan Museum is one of our highlights. Fascinated by the Etruscan civilization, mystery still surrounds the origins of the Etruscans, whose artistic, energetic, pleasure-loving society dominated the western side of Italy from Bologna to Rome for 400 years after 700 BC. The Guarnacci Etruscan Museum is one of the earliest public museums in Europe. It was founded in 1761 when the nobleman Mario Guarnacci, a collector of antiquities, donated this archaeological collection to the citizens of the city of Volterra. This donation turned out to be a far-sighted gesture for Guarnacci not only prevented the dispersal of the contents of the Etruscan burial sites but also bequeathed a prestigious cultural heritage to Volterra. The other pieces on display include tombstones, pottery, ceramics, bronzes, weapons, and a rich numismatic collection with over 3,000 Etruscan, Greek, and Roman coins. Above all, the Etruscans left us gold ornaments. The Etruscans prided themselves particularly on the techniques of filigree, delicate tracery and gold wire, and granulation, tiny particles of gold creating an intricate pattern. Jewelry historians have long wondered how they did it. Married couple from the first century BC is incredibly realistic and the expressions of the faces of the two people is as though they were alive amongst us today. Every wrinkle, every expression of the face is fixed with extraordinary artistic skill. One of Volterra's priceless masterpieces is Shadow of the Evening, a bronze statuette dated to around the third century BC. It represents a slender, elongated figure that evokes the shadow of a human figure projected onto the ground at sunset when the sun is low on the horizon. This very famous work has been displayed in the main museums of the world and is considered the symbol of Volterra. Visit Volterra and enjoy your own discovery into 3,000 years of history.